Hello and welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new. We're at the at-home store and we're going to see a little bit of everything. Are you ready? Let's shop. So starting off, as soon as I walked in the store, this is the first display I saw, which is all things Valentine's Day. They literal condensed it down to one display, which I will say I'm not really mad at. It's it's okay, you know? $20 for this beaded um, throw pillow. Valentine's Day, I don't think, needs like a huge, huge, you know, aisles and aisles of decor. Look at this arch. This arch. That's really what had me. I was just like, that big blow up arch is so good. Love. Never seen anything like that before, especially for Valentine's Day, you know? $20 for the big, huge, heart-shaped throw pillow. That one is a cult classic. We've seen those even at TJ Maxx. Apparently, the at-home store has them too. $15 for this little guy. A little bit smaller than those um, fuzzy ones. They have the candy and treats. They also have these mugs. Now, how cool was that first one? This one, like with that cutout kind of thing on the side. Um, the second one I picked up was a little bit heavy. And then there's this one for $9, the little tumbler with the tic-tac-toe, love. You guys know I love a little tic-tac-toe action, a board, if you will. I really want that one from Hearth and Hand. I really need to figure out if I want it because I'm sure it's gonna sell out as usual. $7 for these kitchen towels. By the way, before I get too carried away, I did mention we're going to see a little bit of everything. Some of that is Easter. Did you, should I say it again? Did you hear me? Easter, like full blown Easter is here at the at home store and 75% off Christmas and they still have a good amount of Christmas, including Christmas trees. I was blown away when I saw that they still had Christmas trees left. Oh, I love these. $5, little like pillowy hearts, very, very cute. Of course, some heart scatter. And this, this one I was surprised to see here and I was definitely interested in seeing how much it cost because we tend to see these mostly at the world market. $30 here. Same length and lots of beading. Like I said, world market. If you guys remember for Christmas, that's the latest time. The latest time. <laughs> that's the last time we saw some of those for Christmas. Um, and I bet you they have them right now for Valentine's Day too. And they'll have them for Easter. Uh, but at the world market, I keep saying the world market. <laughs> <laughs> um, they're 50. They are $50. Okay. Spring wreaths are here, or at least they're starting to come out. Many of the aisles at the at-home store were empty. Like they are definitely clearing Christmas out and bringing spring Easter in. And like I said, the I feel like the entire Easter collection is out already. But I love that one with the little tiny baby pink flowers very cute a lot of the at-home store wreaths are twenty dollars most of them are and those twenty dollar ones are kind of like a small to medium size kind of like somewhat medium then there's the twenty five dollar ones i thought this one was really pretty too and it has like a little bit more going on than the twenty dollar one but it's almost the same size i feel it's like such a small, I mean, those two right there, you can kind of see the difference. There is a difference in size, but it's small, you know? So I guess the $20 ones we consider the small, the $25 ones are medium, and these, do you see these? So like wildflower looking, like I love it, love. <gasps> I forgot that we were going to see these. OMG, they have so much clearance right now on furniture and I love these tables so I had to show them to you a lot of these are just the display I guess that's why it's on like clearance or sale some of the stuff said that it's 25% off I really 
I'm not sure, aside from the price that you're seeing, the tags, how much you would be paying for them. Look at this marble tabletop. So good. $400, display only. And look at this bottom, this base, the bottom. <laughs> $500. See how it says 25% off clearance? So I'm assuming it's just 25% off, but I will say if I'm getting the floor model, the display model, if you will, I need more than 25% off. Okay, at home, I, I kind of need more than 25% off. This little set is really cute for 300. These stools, I was trying to, I was trying to pull it up because this is a high table, but I couldn't do it. But this one right here has already been pulled up. So you see, you definitely can pull these up. I mean, you would have to because it is a high chair. And then same seas here. This is a high top table for 400. Only one stool was out, but it is supposed to come with two. Unless it's the display. So if the display, the other chair isn't there, maybe they'd only have one chair. And there you go. If I'm only getting it with one chair and one table and not like if a chair is missing, essentially, as my son would say, essentially, I should get a bigger discount than 25% off. See here, like this one says $200. That's what it is now. You know, why didn't the other one say it like that? Either way, if you're looking for tables or any other type of furniture they have lots of furniture right now this piece right here i thought was really cool as soon as i saw it i had to walk towards it i love that the doors are like push open like you know they're on that spring thing where is that a spring or a magnet either way you know what i mean <laughs> you just push it open another one that has like what the price is now I thought this was a nice piece. You see how I'm trying to push it? I'm like, oh, these must all be, you know, the push and open uh, ones. No, not this one. <gasps> Love. 170 for the small one. This is that mango wood. I feel like the at-home store has a lot of items. This is where I see mango wood the most. Look at how the handle kind of like just blends into this whole design. I really, really like these. These were definitely my favorite in the furniture section, if you will. Really, really nice. I could not find the price on this piece right here. I saw the boxes like right next to it, to the left there, but I didn't see prices on the boxes either. So I had to move on and here are all the stools. Now, this kind of gives you a good idea. If you've never been to the at-home store, this right here, this shot right here kind of gives you an idea of what the store is like. If none of the other shots were giving you that vibe. This is like a Costco for decor. That's what I always think of. They have these huge displays. It's a gigantic store and it's, it's Costco for, for decor, for furniture and such. Look at this. I thought this was worth showing you. So nice, so much detail. And then I'm like, what is the prize? And here it is. The smallest 400 and that bigger one is 550. I was gonna say 650, it's 550. I don't know, it's nice, it felt nice. It seemed like it's decent quality. Now here are the poofs. Now let me tell you something. Look at that egg, <gasps> foreshadowing. Stay tuned for the Easter. The Easter is good. The Easter decor is so good. I know this is so super early, but listen, Valentine's Day is around the corner and really we're going to have to start decorating for Easter. I mean, let's, let's be serious here. Let's get serious. <laughs> let's get serious about our decor, but I digress. I'm showing you literal this one aisle of these poofs of these stools don't be fooled there's like two other aisles with different styles like that whole like you know um boho vibes like indian vibes moroccan there's a whole other section this green one love 40 dollars. they had this particular one in several different colors here it is in black and then in that rusty color too 
Now here's the Christmas. This blended right in, perfect segue. Like when I went into this aisle, it was the perfect segue into the Christmas discount. 75% off Christmas, and this is what they have left. We're just going super quick through here, okay? Just so you get an idea of what's in the store. Look at the Elf on the Shelf. I will say, as you are about to see, the Elf on the Shelf collection didn't seem to sell well, which I'm so disappointed and kind of surprised about. My family, we here are Elf on the Shelf fans, and so I thought it was a really cute collection, and I don't know, I thought the Elf on the Shelf, oh, look at this piece, the cross, candle holder, love. That is so pretty. This star is also really good. So I was very surprised to see that they still had so much up on the shelf collection left because I thought it was really good. I thought there were way more. See, this is part of the up on the shelf collection. Uh, more up on the shelf fans. Or maybe no one really wanted to decorate with the elf on the shelf theme, I don't know. This lantern, let me tell you, I could not see like the actual price, but just know it's 75% off. It is a gigantic piece and I love it. I think it's so good. Here's more elf on the shelf. This is like when I started to realize like, OMG, like no one wanted the elf on the shelf items. Look at this again. And those are cookie jars, which I think are actually really cute. And those are really big too. It's like the entire collection. Most of what's left for Christmas is up on the shelf, but not all of it, not all of it. I will show you there is, but wait, there's more. There's this whole section right here, black and white snowman vibes. And you see those white bulbs up there. Remember those? That's that milky white that I was obsessing over. So good, so good. They still have some of those left and this is more and more. What are these called? What is that velvet? Um, ornaments. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, wow, Damaris. <laughs> this is what they have left on ornaments, y'all. Still a pretty good, like, I mean, there's some decent colors. Some colors some variety still a good amount like if you really still needed or wanted to get new ornaments i almost forgot it again guys obviously ornaments is not the word for me today okay you get the point there's lots of ornaments left now's the time 75 percent off look at the trees look at the trees i mean is this not good these are 75 percent off a $350 tree right now is $87.50. I did the math because I needed to figure. I was just like, whoa, I might need to get some of these. And by the way, while I was in the store, I saw at least three people walk out with Christmas trees. Just saying. Warning. Just letting you know. Now here it is. Easter 2024 at the at-home store obsessed with this piece it's 70 dollars. i want it it is beautiful and it's a nice size now these little guys were here last year 30 dollars for the larger one 20 for the smaller i think there might be one that's even smaller i didn't see it today i don't think this candle right here honeysuckle yes please very nice it's 40 dollars when you're done with the Candle itself, you get to keep the piece. I mean, of course, it's a whole situation and definitely you would want to keep. This piece right here, it doesn't even belong here, but it's actually cute and it's $19. So there it is, I had to show you. Here is the Easter garland for $12. I say the Easter garland as if this is the one and only Easter garland. <laughs> it's at least the only one that we're going to see today. I will definitely be back and we will be seeing the entire Easter collection. This is so not all of it. These baskets, love. That small one looked like it was $15. As you saw, the price was like ripped off, but you could tell it was like $14.99. And then this larger one is $21.99. Very, very nice. Oh my gosh. Wait till you see this. Do you see the pot? The planter? 
good, very good, a hundred dollars. This olive tree is everything. For a hundred dollars, it's so good. That's fifty dollars less than any of the trees that we've seen at Target. All of the Target trees, whether they're Hearth and Hand, Studio McGee, what they're like 120, 150. This olive tree is so good, and it's a hundred dollars. Again, just saying, I think I might be getting an olive tree. Hopefully they don't sell out by the time I figure it out. Because we all know, I take forever sometimes to figure it out. <laughs> this little platter is super cute with the little bunny ears. Love that. Also, these napkin holders. How cute. I love that the gold is like matte. It's not shiny. Very nice. Was that $15? I think that's at $15. So pretty. This bowl, so, so good. $22 on this one. Now, I haven't mentioned pricing, which is shocking, but here are their eggs. Yeah, when I saw that they put that those bags back there and the other one, I'm like, let me put this bag in here. Give, you know, give some peeps an idea because that, that is perfect. Like, put some, like, eggs in there. So good. But, um... Oh, this platter. Love it too. $22. Another good one. Am I right? Like, is this collection not great? By the way, loving the yellow. I mean, we all know. Like, all the pastel colors are Easter colors. It's a vibe. The yellow, the green, the purple, of course, you know, pinks. But I'm loving this yellow. And apparently the at-home store, you know, is into it too. <laughs> You know, they're, this is what they're giving us. They, they're, they're going strong with the yellow. But there, there's other colors. You'll see. There's, there's going to be more. But wait, there's more. Love these mats. $10 for that one. What's the deal with these thinner mats? What are we doing with those? Are we putting those at the front door? I keep seeing those, but I love this whole checkerboard situation. Love. Either one. Love. But is anybody using that thinner one? Let me know. Give me some ideas. Do I need one? Because I do love these checker ones. So maybe I want to get these. Here's that olive tree again. Had to show it to you yet again. Look at it. It's beautiful. I'm obsessed with it. I'm, I'm a little obsessed with it. This guy right here is $80. Very nice. Another large wood piece. I'm into the yellow, guys. I think maybe... That's going to be my Easter theme this year. Maybe go with the yellow. I don't know. I feel like I was saying something. Did I forget? Did I move on? Did I digress yet again and now I can't remember? $20 for this blanket. It's super soft. Love. And it's yellow. These lanterns. I almost missed them. $30 for the large one. They look like super substantial. $20 for the smaller one. They're not as solid as they look. You know, if they were super solid, they would cost more. So I think it's like a nice medium, you know, like it's like, let me pay less for the look, but it's like, but they do have a little weight to it. It's not like they don't, they're not light, but I just feel like they look heavier than they actually are. Here are the tiny baby eggs. Is that what I was gonna tell you? I love the at-home store like egg collection. I feel like they give us a good variety in the like the little egg assortments and such. These bunnies are super cute. Another large piece. $80. Very nice. So, we're seeing this. We're going to see one more display because at first I didn't see it. And then I'm like, no, there's no way. I know I'm coming back and we're going to go into the Easter aisle or aisles, but I had to show you the other display. I couldn't leave without showing it to you. This one is 25. There's that yellow. What is that velvet? Is that a velvet bow I see in yellow? Oh, yes. Tis the season of yellow is the easter color for 2024 i don't know what i just said i just totally made that up but the point i'm trying to make is that i'm, I'm voting yellow 
pastel yellow is the Easter color for the year. Hashtag all the things. This piece right here is also not Easter necessarily. It's just random, but it's $15 and I thought it was cool because it has like the, the, the bottle opener on the side. So I thought that was fun. $30 for this guy. Love, love the green, love like the checkerboard, but it's all, you know, one color. Very nice. Oh boy, here's that display. Do you see this? How cute are these bunnies? The ears are posable, like you can go ahead and pose them how you wish. The wreath around the neck or like the flower uh, choker <laughs> vibes, so good. Of course, a flower crown, number one. I approve 100%. Look at how cute they look next to each other. And then this egg love it's like we're going oversized for easter that's like the vibe on top of the yellow it's also an oversized easter for 2024 look at that blue egg remember the foreshadowing we saw earlier there they are so they have like a huge gigantic one and then one that's a little bit smaller these bunnies with their little flower chokers also so cute 20 for this one right here like I'm loving the yellow, but I'm also loving what's happening over here with the florals. $10 for these. They have them in the green. They have this little pinkish, peachy vibe. I'm sure they'll probably have them in other colors. This is just the beginning. I kept saying before, like, look at that lantern. Look at that. So good. Um, that I, I'm pretty sure their entire Easter collection is out, but probably not. Now that I think about it, probably not. So we shall see what else they bring in and what other colors. Uh, but those fuzzy bunnies that we just saw, I believe Walmart had them last year. Did they not? I'm almost 100% sure Walmart had them, but they didn't have this many varieties in like sizes and they didn't have these colors. The, the Walmart ones were like more vibrant, I think. They weren't pastel colors, if I remember correctly. These little sheeps, they're the cutest thing. I love the sheeps, that's so cute. Here's a little egg pillow action, all white, love. The struggle of finding the price for me, $20 for these. I also feel like, you know how I mentioned that the wreaths tend to be, like they tend to have a lot of $20 wreaths. They also tend to have a lot of $20 throw pillows as well. Here's some of the green, the greenery, if you will. These bunnies, like I love seeing the green. These are 20, but these are like that plasticky green, not the mossy green. I'm more into like the mossy green than the plastic green. $7 for these candles, very cute. Oh, but wait till you see these. OMG. This little basket is cute, love. $8. Look at this. I, I, I was going to show you that other egg, but I couldn't and I forgot to go back to it too. <laughs> because look at these. $7 for these little votive bunnies. They're candles. So cute. Obsessed with those. Here's that gar the garland. Here's the Easter garland again. And then this bunny right here. Again, this is that. Um, see, I can tolerate it more here. The bunnies themselves, I don't like that hard greenery. These are 30. But like this, for like a front door wreath situation, I don't mind it. Here's the big daddy egg. It's $110. Super sized Easter right there. Speaking of Super Size Easter, I'm telling you, it really is. Happy Easter sign right here. Love the colors. Everything about it, gigantic. I was going to try to pull this out to see how much it was. I mean, this thing goes all the way. Do you see that? It's just super long. It does have a kickstand and it's super beautiful. Hopefully the next time I'm in here, I'll be able to like, they'll have it like on display, standing up or something, and I'll be able to see the price. This lantern that we saw before is $50. 
And here's a little sneak peek at the pillows. That is going to be it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Click the notification bell so you won't miss any of my upcoming videos. And let's keep the party going by clicking on one of these videos right here on the screen. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.